Hey guys, this is Michael with Quiet Lawn. I own an all-electric lawn service. Uh, we've been in business for about five years using nothing but battery-powered equipment. Um, if you are using handheld blowers such as Ego, our favorite models of Ego are the 580 CFM and the six, new 650 CFM models. Now they're very powerful. Uh, if you use ones like this or the Greenworks handheld blower that have the normal trigger plus a turbo button, uh, this will be pretty much this will work for either of those but one of the uh one of the big questions we get is about how to extend the battery uh life of the equipment while you're using it and i'm going to show you how we use our handheld blowers and how some ways that you can use it that are going to use up your battery really quickly um, because we our crews average probably 10 to 15 yards a day and they usually go through a battery and a half maybe two batteries a day so each one of these five amp hour batteries uh, we typically get about maybe six or half a dozen or so yards uh, give or take uh, and i'm going to show you how, you how we do that okay so here's the uh, driveway at the shop and it'd be a perfect place to show you how we use our ego and our handheld blowers um these blowers are really powerful especially when you use this turbo feature uh, this turbo feature is great for blasting off heavy amounts of debris uh, for blasting off dirt after you use a stick edger along the driveway and we use it a lot the problem is if you hold this thing this turbo button down like that and just hold it the whole time this battery is going to be dead in 10 or 15 minutes so what we figured out years ago and what we do is we use that turbo button in short surges like half a second or a second and what that does is each time you push that it sends out a burst of air that will carry off some of those heavier debris you're not able to get so if i'm blowing off this driveway what i'm going to do is i'm going to walk up the middle of the driveway and i'm going to go from side to side and when i get over here i'm going to hit the turbo button real quick go to the let off of it I'm, I'm keeping the regular trigger down all the way because that doesn't use a ton of battery so i've got it full power without turbo and then i'm just surging that turbo but i'm doing that as i go side to side like this So you can see how strong these blowers are and like i said the whole time i'm holding the the regular trigger of the throttle down all the way and then i'm just i'm just using that turbo button uh just to provide some extra volume of air that really blasts off that heavy stuff and obviously with all these pine needles that have fallen the last few weeks uh you know this is much thicker than your typical maintenance job where you're mowing a yard but you can see how good these blowers really work
can also use your blower to kind of tuck your pine straw too i'm sure you guys that uh deal with pine straw a lot you're familiar with that technique too but i'm just kind of feathering and bouncing my nozzle up and down so i believe i'll make a video next uh we're going to come out here and do some uh, mulching with the green marks and see how well it does as far as suction with the uh, with the pine needles here uh, and we'll compare that to uh, one of our ego push mowers uh, but you can see how great these blowers work uh, we love them uh, we were using the 580s until these six uh, 650s came out and these 650s are awesome uh, you know so were the 580s I think either are very adequate uh, or more than adequate for uh, normal maintenance mowing stuff like that. as far as uh, leaf cleanups and heavier duty stuff uh, they are very powerful but you're going to need a lot of batteries or you're going to need to you know carry a few batteries and a rapid charger with you uh, because you know for something like that it's definitely definitely going to use a lot of battery but yeah that's it i'd love to uh hear your feedback in the comments if you found any techniques that work for you um, but that's how i do it that's the way you can use the full power of this piece of equipment so that you can be fast and efficient and also uh, conserve your battery and like i said normal size yards will do around half a dozen sometimes you know eight or so uh with this uh with these five amp hour batteries and using it this way